What's up guys? Welcome to another episode of Bass Union. My name is Joseph Ferrosco and today we're picking up the Ranger Z520 that I just had all rigged up at Bass Pro Shops. The man behind all the way, we got Chris Martin right here. Chris, we're picking up the Ranger today. You've had the boat for a little bit now, got it all rigged up exactly how I wanted it. I mean, I came at you with a monster list of stuff and you guys nailed it. Um, you know, real quick, Chris, can you walk us through some of the stuff that Absolutely. you did for the Absolutely. <laughs> like I said, we had a monster list of things to do, uh, swapping everything off his old Triton onto this one, plus plus adding a few things to, to the Ranger. Uh, we can go through and show you a couple things we added. Uh, we added the drain tight, uh, auto drain plug, uh, flow right with the, with the lever inside the splash well. We added a charger plug as well next to it. Um, there's so many things on this thing it's hard to remember exactly everything we yeah. did but we, gotta we, see we really reconfigured his his whole uh back of the boat installed his lithiums from his triton into this one uh, moved his oil reservoir and actually installed a remote oil fill that wasn't there before um as you can see there's not much room in there to add anything else <laughs> yeah. uh, Just, uh... but but super clean charger uh everything in there um Biggest thing we did though was was Joe's craziness with all his graphs. <laughs> uh, this boat's this running five graphs on this boat. Um, we've got two on the on the console, a Hummerbird 12 and an HDS 12 Lowrance, uh, running side view on both. Um, up front, he's got the the Panoptics set up with two separate units for Panoptics: Scout mode and Forward mode, with a Lowrance HDS 12 alongside. Uh, running down scan um, which super super clean um, bass boat technologies mount uh, triple stack um, probably one of the cleanest mounts I've ever seen uh, as far as that goes you know we're still running the same transducers and everything that he had on the other boat uh, as well but but um, yeah we got the dual boom forward perspective yes uh, a whole lot of things um <laughs> we we even came through and uh took his passenger console out which yep. which is epoxied in on these years in the rangers not really meant to come out but but uh, with a little work you can get them out open up your whole deck space um wow. cleaned up we made a we made a plate to cover up the old holes uh to make it look cleaner uh but we went through this boat and uh and made it more usable and okay, user friendly and uh we put our touch on it. Man. So I'm glad to hear Joe's happy with it. I love it, man. This platform's gonna be perfect for guiding now. We're gonna be able to have clients up front, Roslate on the deck, side by side, no room, no problem, plenty of space. And uh, really appreciate all the work you guys did. Super clean. You even put a, a nice fuse box that has all the graphs connected to it. That way, if I have any electrical issues, I can go straight to that and know exactly what's going on. But Chris, I am excited for this thing and ready to rip some lips brother i'm glad to hear it maybe i can get out with you and do that uh with you sometime soon absolutely man and this guy right here you got to watch out for him on the tournament trail what you were aoi on the new gen last AOI year right new gen last year on the pro side um doing it again this year <laughs> uh, along with the team circuit as well on the new gen uh, but uh, if, I, if I didn't have to spend so much time here you'd really have to watch out for me i'd be fishing more oh yeah <laughs> Well, that's it, guys. This is, you know, the quick revealing of the Ranger from here on out. Oh, and did I mention we sold the Triton yesterday? So she's gone. We are officially full Ranger now in these videos, in these tournaments, guiding. So it's going to be a lot of fun. It's going to be a learning process. Going to get used to this thing. But like I said, Chris got it all rigged up and ready for me to roll. So, again, I'm super appreciative to him. So if you guys haven't already, like, subscribe. Check out Chris Martin, Facebook, Instagram. This guy's a stick. And we'll see you guys in the next one.